Cool. All right. What's up, everybody? Um, happy Monday evening. So getting through your Monday, uh, 6 p.m. wide with Anthony. And uh, here's what we got going on today. All right. So we're going to have five rounds. We're going to have two minutes on, one minute off. And inside those rounds, what we're going to do is, okay, in two minutes, you are going to do 20 jump lunges or 20 regular body weight alternating lunges. Okay. Um, if you can do the bounds, that's awesome. If not, no worries. 20 just alternating lunges is perfect. Into that, we're going to do 15 weighted sit-ups okay if you have something to hold on to to spice up that sit-up awesome go for it if not 15 regular sit-ups is good and then within the rest of that two minute window whatever time is left over you are doing as many burpees as possible all right so that's what we got going on all right after your two minutes is up we're gonna rest for one minute and from there we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna hit another round and another round and another round until we complete five rounds okay so two minutes of work one minute of rest 20 jump lunges 15 sit-ups as many burpees as possible in your remaining time. All right, so that's what we got going on tonight. Um, for your warm up, what we got is three rounds. We are going to do five yoga push ups, 10 side lunges, and a 30 second squat hold. All right, just starting to loosen up, get the blood flowing a little bit. If we've been sitting at the desk all day um, or just kind of lounging around, which is awesome, uh, want to get the blood flowing a little bit, loosen those bodies up. Okay, so that's what we got going on. Folks, we're going to go ahead and dive right in. All right, so get your mat set up, find your space. We're starting with five yoga push-ups. So in that push-up position, we're gonna scoop through, press through in that nice chaturanga position, pressing through the elbows, and then back into the shoulders. Go ahead and give me five of them, everybody. Nice work, nice work. And each round, you can spice it up, or excuse me, speed it up a little bit. Spice it up. Speed it up a little bit um, as the body starts to warm up and wake up. Last one here, and back into those shoulders. Hey, after you hit five of those, go ahead and take that nice wide stance. We are going to hit 10 side lunges. So just keeping that foot nice and flat, chest is up, and we're going side to side for 10. Hopefully your Monday's going well, getting this week off to a good start. After you hit 10 of those, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to go ahead and we have a 30 second squat hold. So get into position, got the stopwatch going, you're going to go ahead, set your feet, hold that good position, try to keep that chest nice and vertical, trying to get those hips below parallel, chest nice and tall, 30 seconds. If you want to, you can gently push out on the knees, all right, start to open up those hips. Biggest thing is I want to make sure we're maintaining an active position and we're good. 10 seconds left. And three, two, one, go ahead, come out of that and start round number two. All right, we have uh, two more rounds of this. We're gonna talk about the workout one more time and we'll get going. When you finish your five, you can go ahead, hop up, and you can begin that second round of 10 side lunges. All right. Wide stance, sitting back into that hip, trying to keep this foot nice and flat, as deep as you can. If your chest can stay vertical, that's great. If you need to set the hands down, it's all good. I really want to focus on a nice flat foot. Loosen up the adductors or the groin muscles. Make those squats nice and comfy. And when you hit 10, we're going back into a 30 second squat hold. Get comfortable in this bottom position. Chest vertical, hips below parallel. My knees are in line with my big toes. It's okay if that knee is slightly over as long as my heels are not coming up. Feet stay nice and flat. 20 seconds in, 10 seconds left. And three, two, one. Awesome job. All right, hey, we got one set left. So go ahead, find your push up position. Let's hit those five yoga push ups.
right? Hopefully you're chipping your way through this final set of your warm up, feeling a little bit looser each set as we're gonna go ahead and get started very soon. Hopefully we're starting to feel a little bit better each round. Let's get that final set of side lunges here, everybody. Maybe sitting a little deeper into that hip each time. Side to side. Might feel a little bit in the hamstrings as well. It's all good. No harm in getting those warmed up as well. And when you finish those 10, we have our last 30 second squat hold. So find that position. I like my feet about shoulder width apart, toes slightly turned out. It allows me to sit into that good position. And we got 30 seconds here. Nice active squat. If you drop something in your house and you got a good squat, just squat down and grab it. No need to throw that back out. Last 10 seconds. And three, two, one, we can go ahead and come out of that. All right, and so we should be nice and warmed up now. What we're gonna do is we're gonna talk about um, the workout one more time, and then we're gonna go ahead and dive in. So what we have going on, five rounds. Be two minutes on and one minute off, okay? Now within those two minutes, you're going to complete 20 jump lunges or 20 body weight alternating lunges, okay? The jumping is awesome if you can do it, if not, 20 lunges is perfect. From there, we have 15 weighted sit-ups or 15 regular sit-ups. I wanna give the weighted option. If people wanna do a little bit more, if you're feeling up to it, that's awesome. Now, in the remaining time that we have left in that two minute window, you have as many burpees as possible, okay? So we're trying to get all that work done, 20 and 15, to get to those burpees, to chip away, to add up all those reps. When we get to the two minute mark, we rest for one minute, we're gonna repeat that five times. So we got a nice 15 minute workout coming out for us. Um, we should be nice and warm. If you have any questions, folks, please feel free, throw it into the comments. Um, real quick, I'll demo the movements for us. Uh, I wanna give you a second to go ahead, feel them out, do a few, and then we'll get all set up, all right? I'll man the clock, so no worries there. All you gotta do is work when I work, rest when I rest, and we should be a-okay. All right, let's go ahead, folks, start to set up that room for your lunges tonight. All right, since they are jump lunges, you're gonna go ahead, take a step back, knee taps that ground, and from here, Explode up, tap that knee, open those hips. All right, so that's our jump lunge there for the weighted sit up. If you got something, you can tuck it underneath the chin. You can go into that butterfly position or feet flat, does not matter. Right underneath the chin, sit back and sit up. Now, you may also hold it in a curl position right here and sit up. It's whichever works best for you. You got 15 of those, and then whatever time's left over, you know the drill, burpees. So hit the deck, jump up, little clap overhead, as many as we can get done. All right, so I'm gonna give you a second, get everything squared away, get all set up, and then we're gonna go ahead and dive on in. All right, five rounds tonight. So timer is set, ladies and gentlemen. All right, we have a 10 second countdown starting now, starting with our 20 jump lunges. In three, two, one. Here we go, everybody. Trying to keep that chest nice and vertical. Awesome job. All right, 20 of those out of the way. Going into our 15 weighted sit-ups. Nice work, folks. Keep chipping away. Right. 
one minute in. Halfway there. All right. Well, looks like we got a minute of burpees, everybody. So go ahead, stand up out of those sit-ups. 50 seconds left, as many as you can get in. Let's go. seconds. Come on, 20 seconds left on that clock. books. We got four rounds left. Try to tally up those total burpees. Keep a little running score for you. All right, good round one, everybody. Got about 40 seconds left of rest, and then we are diving back in. Twenty seconds, folks. You start back up at the top at your twenty jump lunges. Hey, if we need to scale the burpees and up down, it's a great option. All right, it's just a burpee without the push up. I'll do a few in this round so you can see. And hey, we're going in five. And let's begin round number two. Twenty jump lunges. Here we go. To those sit-ups everybody come on keep it rolling don't try to go slow so you get less time on those burpees keep it moving One minute left. All right, another minute of burpees. 50 seconds left in this round. Come on, let's keep it rolling. Get those reps in. Hey, need to do an up down. Just set the hands, kick back and kick up. That is a great scaling option for us if you need to. All right, keep it up. Whatever keeps you moving. seconds. Time, all right, two down. Nice job, everybody, nice job. Keep it rolling, hey, halfway around right here, all right? Let's keep it up. This hair is getting wild. If you've been with me every Monday, you've been able to see the growth. <laughs> All right, 30 seconds left. We're starting round number three, back up at the top. 20 jump lunges. <sighs> Sometimes water just tastes so good. It really does. 10 seconds. 
All right, listen up. We're going in three, two, one, and begin. Since quarantine started, here we go. 15 weighted sit ups. Keeping it consistent. That's what we're looking for. Get those burpees going, folks. Come on. We got 40 seconds left. Round number three. Halfway around. Let's go. work hey three down over that hump coming back down coming home Woo. folks the real goal here try to get to those burpees at around the same time each time and then try to get as many burpees as you can but trying to keep that number consistent all right Trying to keep, uh, let's say you hit some 10 in round number one, We're trying to hit eight to 10 every set. All right, that's where we really find that fitness and that consistency across time, all right? We got 20 seconds to start round number four. Ten seconds. All right, you're gonna hear the clock go in. Three, two, one. And here we go, round number four. Come on, 20 lunges. All right, keep it up, keep it up. All right. Hit the deck, everybody. You got your 15 sit-ups. Come on, 30 seconds in. go here we go one minute left come on let's hop up let's get those burpees going come on everybody let's do it hit the deck
right. Hey, one left. That's it. One round left and we're done for the night. Okay. Come on. Let's keep it up. Let's keep it up. We're doing it together. Don't forget. Come on. Don't let me down. Here we got about 40 seconds left in our rest. Whoo. All right. Getting that week started. A little workout, a lot of burpees. 15 minutes, a whole lot of burpees. Hey, 20 seconds, all right? So get set, final set of jump lunges right here. We're going in 10. All right, you heard that clock. Let's get going, everybody. Final set. All right. 20 in the books. Final time here in those sit-ups. Let's make them count. Come on. Everybody, come on, hop up, get it going. All right, you got less than one minute to get as many burpees as you can. Come on, let's do it. Forty seconds. Come on, 20. Some job folks hey here's what I want to do all right I don't just want to send us out of here with the heart rate through the roof so here's what I want to do okay we just did a ton of upper body work there as well as a good amount of squats so I want you to take your dumbbell or your kettlebell whatever you're using to sit up let's take a knee we're going to tuck our hips forward chest tall I want us to take a big nose breath in when we do that we're gonna exhale and sit into that hip flexor, okay? So let's go ahead. Big nose breath, tuck the hips, and exhale through. Sit deep into that stretch. Awesome job. Hey, we should be feeling it through the quadricep, maybe in the hip flexor, maybe even slightly up in that abdominal area. It's where that hip flexor comes and runs through the pelvis and actually attaches on the lower back vertebrae. So. If you have tight hips, and all of a sudden you're like, yeah, my lower back does bother me. That might be why, all right? I'm not a doctor, but I did stay at a Holiday Inn last night. I'm just kidding, I did not. <laughs> but for real, that's where all that stuff attaches, okay? So if this stuff's all gunked up and tight, it's a good chance that lower back's bothering you as well. Let's go ahead, switch sides. Some of you may have gotten that joke if you watch TV. Some of you may have been like, I have no idea what this kid's talking about. That's <laughs> all good. Hey, big nose breath in. Tuck the hips and exhale, fall forward. 
Ooh, see, I feel a lot more stretch in my quadricep on this side. This side might be a little bit tighter on me. All right, plenty of imbalances happen throughout movement, um, throughout sedentariness. Some of us may be doing a lot more sitting than we're used to. Hips may be a little bit tighter, all right? So it's a big focus on biggest goal. We don't want to come out of this with more aches and pains than we went into. All right, that's a, that's a big thing. Some of us may be moving more um, because we have more time. So key priorities, take care of yourself always, all right? Whether it is uh, physically, mentally, all that stuff is so important, especially now more than ever. All right, so go ahead, sit deep into that stretch one more time. And we're gonna go ahead and come out of that. Awesome work tonight, everybody. Hey, I sincerely mean it. Thank you so much for allowing me to uh, continue to coach. All right, it is, it's what I do. And I'm so thankful that everybody continues to come to class, uh, watches these videos after we record them. It really means a lot to all of us coaches. Um, we can't wait to see you again. Uh, you know, we want to be in there, but uh, we know this is the safest thing. So we hope to continue to see you here. Hope to continue uh, to see you in the future. And uh, stay safe, everybody. Have yourself a great Monday. I'll see y'all later on in the week, all right?